Hi, it's Mark Coleman from Paul's Photo, the lab at Paul's Photo, and the Creative Photo Academy. It's another great day to be creative. And we're here in Joshua Tree today. And you've seen this building before. This is the Ryan Adobe at Ryan Campground in Joshua Tree. And I just wanted to thank all of you who donated money that helped us raise the money to restore this, this building. You know, it was damaged by vandals, and they came out, and the National Park Service with some great restoration team re, re adobed it, and it just looks beautiful. It's gorgeous. It's back to being where we can use again as a photo backdrop. So what do I see here? I see shapes and lines. It's early in the morning. So you've got a lot of shadowing and you've got a lot of texture here and there. So I see this great wall with the window on the other side. So I'm gonna take my 24 to 70 at 70 millimeters. I'm gonna zoom in. I'm aperture priority F11. Actually, 70 is a little too much. I'm gonna back up because I want the foreshortening of the telephoto lens. Focusing on the foreground to make the picture. There it is, that's what I see and that's what I feel. So we wanna capture shapes and lines. We're always looking for light and dark, shadow, shape, texture, form, and then using the camera to create that, to capture it. Mark Coleman from Paul's Photo, the lab at Paul's Photo and the Creative Photo Academy, thanking you for helping us restore the Ryan Adobe. Thank you to the National Park Service. Thank you to the folks from Cornerstone for doing the work. And thank you for supporting us in all we do. Mark Coleman from Paul's Photo, the lab at Paul's Photo. Have a great day, and let's be creative.